wasn't sure we'd coming back, so I went ahead and made a fire. I'm guessing this has something to do with bread. I remember you telling me about some guy in Boston. Is it him? How are you feeling? Really? You know what it feels like to want to die? That's why you came up here. To kill yourself? No, I came because I couldn't. I stood on those tracks and I watched that train come right at me. The light was so bright. It was like relief. Like a light at the end of the tunnel and loud enough to just drown it all out. I hate it. I hate living this. I hate being gay. <laughs> oh, you stupid son of a bitch! Are you kidding me? Next time you feel like offing yourself, you come and find me. Talk to me. You don't go pulling crap like this. I am your friend. I don't give a shit who you choose to love, be with. I love you. Who you are. The day you told me, it was one of the most defining moments of our friendship. Yeah, I wonder why. You trusted me. Before your family, before anyone else in your life, you told me. Look at me. Sammy, stop staring at the dirt. Say it. Promise me you'll call me next time you feel like you can't take it anymore. Promise me, Sammy. Okay, fine, I promise, I'll call. Good. I'm sorry for slapping you, but you pissed me off. <laughs> <laughs>